I am a, um, what I like to call a curator. My family likes to call me a um, hoarder. That's not true. But I, I do find that when I'm traveling around and driving around, that when I see kind of amazing things, and that could be an old wool shirt or an old beat up canoe or uh, some kind of book or volume or piece of art, like I, I find that I can't leave it behind and consequently these things have become collections. I do purge every so many years and, and try to get rid of as much stuff as possible and then you realize you've just created a void to um, get more stuff. My name is Matt Horanik. I'm the founder editor of William Brown Magazine. We are up on William Brown Road at William Brown Farm, quote unquote. This is the place that I bought some 20 years ago. And uh, it's not only such a safe, amazing, wonderful place to be, it's one of the most inspiring places for me. I spend uh, a lot of time up here and the relationship between the city and the country is, is, is a big element of um, of those inspirations and ultimately what helped create the magazine W.M. Brown. The biggest inspiration from the magazine is to create this analog, very slow moving thing. We live in this very kind of noisy, frantic digital world and as a lover of magazines and kind of growing up in the magazine business, I was determined not to have this go away. Uh, I like the idea that it doesn't require a charge. Um, it's not backlit. You could spill a drink on it. You could roll it up and put it in your back pocket. You could take it to the beach. You could take it to the pool. I, I think that that's what I always loved about magazines and in the current climate that is so dramatically shifting to digital. And I totally understand that that's a big part of the current modern world. I, I, it was very important, me, very important for me to create a physical analog thing uh, that you kind of digest in a digital way. It's not long form, it's, it's short articles impacted by visuals, but just something that can live uh, on a shelf, uh, on a coffee table, you could hand it to a friend, and um, it's evergreen.